Half a day, the polls are officially closed and the ballot boxes will begin their procession to Election Central at the University of Guam in Mingilao. While we wait for the tabulation process to begin, but in the meantime, the results of the University of Guam's exit poll following today's decision 2012 general election project a strong Democrat majority for the forthcoming 32nd Guam legislature. The polls were conducted by undergraduate public administration students with a sample size of 600 people through 6.30 p.m. The data returned the following results. The top 15 at number one, Judy Wanpat with 303 votes. Frank Uggen Jr., 299 votes. Dennis Rodriguez Jr., 281. Tom Atta, 272. And making the top five is Michael Sin Nicholas, a newcomer, at 269 votes. At number six in the UOG student exit poll, Tommy Morrison with 261 votes. Number seven and eight tied between Ben Pangolinan and Tina Munya Barnes with 251 votes. At number nine, Vice Speaker BJ Cruz with 247 votes. And rounding out the top 10, incumbent Judy Guthers with 239 votes. Number 11, Rory Respicio with 231 votes. Number 12, Michael Limpiaco, 227. Number 13, incumbent Tony Atta with 222 votes. Number 14, Chris Duenas with 215 votes. And your final 15, Adolfo Palacios with 213. That makes for an 11-4 super majority for the Democrats. But at number 16 is not too far behind. It is Republican Dr. Ali Yamashita with 212 votes. Number 17, Brant McCready with 207 votes. Followed by Joseph Augustine with 203 votes. And Mana Silva Tyron at 19 with 191 votes. And Rollin Bloss in the 20th spot with 176 votes. According to political analyst Ron McNinch, the last five places tend to shift somewhat, particularly the final three. You can read the results from our, the exit poll on our website. Make sure to join us back here on TV8 at 10 p.m. as we kick off our live coverage of the results from Decision 2012. We'll see you then.